All right, so it's 3.40 p.m. Sunday for report. Um, just have a couple of things to do. Um, well, I have a new use of data, you know. What happened to your gaygob.com account, you know? That's why I remember you from. Gaygob.com, remember you were on your G-A-Y-G-O-T-A-H. Well, whatever happened to that site, you know? It was like, uh, 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 because Tony had them close it down because he knew there was minors in there. There was no minors in that site. Dark University, it was a college thing, you know? Dark University closed down because Tony was a hater. He's an old man. How old was oh, Tony? was 74 years old and he had them close it down. Um, next, evidence. You don't go out. You, um, you, you don't let us do anything in life. You de you're a detective for Ricky and me. You want to look in our drawers. You want to look in our clothes and our pockets. You want to go and, and call people and tell us we can't do stuff. You want to control our whole life, Evelyn. And 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 the truth is, you can't control your kids, Evelyn. You, um, you, you, you can't. That's not how you think. That's what Jennifer. Did. All those people did for the parents, and they came out successful kids. And you say that your kids are failure. No, you set them up for failure. Because good kids always end up telling you the truth sooner or later, and they always can go and confide in you. But I can't confide on you for anything. Um, or they remember misconnections on Craigslist. You have one misconnection on Craigslist, and and you checked them, and you didn't know it was for you. No, and you read that one. You had a misconnection. Was it for New York Times? Was it for Club? No, it was a middle. It was a war. None of war. You had a misconnection. Is that kid still single? Yeah. How old is he now? Twenty? No, thirty-two. No. Is he from Rupert? No, he's from Edison. Is it Argy with the sun? No, no. He thought it was Argy with the sun. That's what happened when you were in He thought it was you. I know him. Does he still look in his time? Is he a dumb guy? He's a Republican. He liked you, yeah. Uh, so we're gonna find a misconnection. Misconnection in crisis is if you like someone, and it doesn't matter if it's straight or gay or whatever you are, same size or bicep. If and you, if you go somewhere and you like the person, they really like you, they, and, they don't, and they're very shy, or they don't, and you were busy with all your parents, or this, they go online and they, they write that they saw you in a certain place, and then you go there. And how many people were successful in that zero? So they really want to be successful in this connection. It's like a catfish, but a reality catfish. I don't know what the first catfish. So if yours is an Edison, where are Oki Pro? No. But none of the party party. Isn't it? He's from Islam. He's Indian, not white. Um, they can go to college uh, when he went to college in the East Coast, the West Coast. He went to Berkeley. So Berkeley's there. He has light eyes, no, brown eyes. He has long hair, no. Short brown eyes. He's Italian, no. He's white, white, no. He's French, no. He's German. He's a German kid. Um, uh, we have to talk more details. Did he go to Edison High School? The, the one over there. Does he work? He works in Jersey, no, he works in the city. What does he do in the city? He works in the bank, no, in the store, no, no. at the hospital. So he works at NYU and Langley Road, no. He works at Mount, um, Beth, um, Mount Sinai. The one on 96th Street, no, the one um, on 10th Avenue. What he does there, he's a doctor, no, he's a nurse. He's a registered nurse. In the ER, no. And the chronology, no. Do I know the gynecology, no. Pediatrician nurse at the Mount Sinai. So you can find him on Mount Sinai. I saw the misconnection. Did I ever have one there? Anybody else? I don't know. I don't have one there. Joey Biden. Alright, Evelyn, tú le das mal de ojo, mal, the word today is mal de ojo, give me some bad luck. Tú le das mal de ojo a la gente. Tú siempre le das mal de ojo a todo el mundo. Tú, tú, el chacho, la envidia que tú le tienes a uno, tú le das mal de ojo a mí, a todo el mundo. Alright, I want to talk about presidential parents. I have to come up with a list here now. I have a lot. All right, Joe Biden, the hip, his, uh, Hank Henderson, did his parents come and visit the White House? No, no, the Donald Trump parents came and visited the White House, no. Did Barack Obama's parents come and visit the White House, no. Did George Bush's, Bar did Barbara Bush came and visit the White House when he was president? George Bush, no, no. They didn't come visit, did Bill Clinton's parents were alive? No, no. Did they come visit the White House, no, no. Did George Sr., George H. W. Bush's parents come visit the White House? No, no. Did Ronald Reagan's parents come and visit the White House? No. Did Jimmy Carter's parents come and visit the White House? No. No, no. Did General Ford's parents come and visit the White House? No. Did Richard Nixon's parents come and visit the White House? No, no. Did Lyndon B. Johnson's parents come and visit the White House? No, no. Did John F. Kennedy's biological parents visit the White House? No, no. Did Eva Eisenhower's parents visit the White House? No, no. The Truman's? No, no. Did this happen every single time? No, no. 
happens that every, every, I don't know why every president's mom doesn't want the kids to be president. I don't, I don't, think so. I don't know why you guys have so chicken to do something being a president of the United States of America. This is not working the same six companies, you know. I wish I had two dads and stuff. Women are haters. Women are haters. You can't be the first one to be proud to come to the White House. No. You're doing the same thing that all of them do. That's why Barbara Bush didn't endorse George, um, George W. Bush. But she did endorse Jeff Bush because she knew Jeff Bush was going to win. I feel like I might have um, Next one, I got And then I'm tired. People controlling me. Either way, when I think I have the most freedom and, and I have a free zone, then trust me, someone is lurking. And then my mom has always been nosy and she, she has to know everything. And then I go to Jersey, it's the same thing. Then I have Tony next to me and he's always lurking. I never have my full freedom. Someone always knows what I'm doing. I'm tired of that shit. It's happened all my life. All right, the next one is Evelyn. Una cosa que es en España. Tú no me das la cara ni un, son 10 meses y 26 días y tú no me has dado la cara. Tú vives 15 minutos en un vehículo, en un Uber, puedes venirme aquí en 15 minutos y tú, de, como mujer y como madre, no me has dado la cara. No me has dado la cara. Y si yo voy a la policía, la policía, no, tú me tienes que dar la cara, cabrona. Hijo de gran puta, tú me tienes que dar la cara. ¿Por qué tú no me das la cara? Es la persona que no tiene nada que esconder y no está culpable y no hizo nada malo. Da la cara. 